All right, joining us now, we're in the spin room, is Trump's campaign manager, Kellyanne Conway. Uh, one thing, Frank Luntz had a big win for Trump tonight. Yes, in his dial. Oh. Absolutely. And I think most of America will agree with that if they're being honest, if they actually watch the debate and not the post spin. You saw a very resolute Donald Trump tonight focus showing why he is ready to be commander in chief and president on day one, Sean. This is a guy who took the case to Hillary Clinton, as so many people wanted him to, um, on Syria, on the emails, on Benghazi, on, uh, on frankly, It was funny when he said acid wash. Acid like, wash the emails. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Bleach fit, acid wash, it's all the same. Yeah. Look, we, he hears people all the time out in the stump when he's traveling around this country. They're so frustrated that yet again a different law, a different set of standards applied to Hillary Clinton over her emails than does apply to other people who break the law. He also said, look, if I'm president, you're not going to get a pass. I, you will be prosecuted. There were so many good lines by him. I think the difference, from my perspective, this debate and the last debate, I don't know if he was holding back. I don't know if it was by design. But he went, she had gone after him hard. Tim Kaine regurgitated the talking points. And yeah. finally he said, okay. Let's play. Yeah, let's and that needs to be with Donald came to Trump. Play. He, he came, came to, to play. play. And look, he told 88 million Americans on live TV last time that he had come to do some rough stuff about Hillary and her treatment of women in her husband's life, uh, and that he decided not to at that moment. But tonight he realized that there's so much to be gained by doing that, that if this woman's going to be president of the United States, you have to put it all out there, and you have to let people realize that she represents the past and the status quo and a rigged, corrupt system. He kept going back to this. She's been there. He, by the, the way, she's themes, been there longer the than 30 themes. years. The big things, exactly. right? Exactly. He was being polite. She's yeah. been there much more than 30 years and doesn't have much product or deliverable to show for it. He's absolutely right. And I'll put it in my own words. If she's been there all these years, why do millions of American women don't have health care insurance, health insurance? Why are so many of them living in poverty, millions and millions of women? What is the product? She said, I'm fighting for women. I'm fighting for women. And he said at the end, I respect the fact that she's a fighter. And that's true. But she's always been fighting for herself. And I think if you look at her career, and really is herself. always Hillary first. Mm -hmm. And he's putting America first. Let me go through the differences because they all came out tonight. Radical Islam, say it or don't say it. Vet refugees, increase the number of vet refugees or you don't. The economy, raise taxes, cut taxes. Uh, you build a wall, you don't build a wall. You know, on every single issue, he prosecuted the case about Benghazi, about Iraq, about Syria, about Putin, yes. about straight on down the line. This was a substantive debate on top of everything else. And he brought up the issues of her character, the emails, the bleach pit. And by the way, even the treatment of women by the Clintons, which was the big issue supposedly coming into this debate, I would say he put that to rest. Yes, and whether it's some of the reaction he received this weekend, Sean, or in tonight's debate, he's showing that this contest is us versus them. Who's the them? It's the elite, it's the media, it's sometimes it's he the really establishment. He really is anti-establishment. Yes, he and, is, he's, and he's, he's uh, conveying that message on behalf of the people. I mean, look, he's built a movement, and people feel like they're a part of that. And they don't want him to throw in the towel. They want to see what they saw tonight, which is somebody who's willing to take the case directly to her and willing to stand up for their principles. I was very proud of him many times tonight. Mm -hmm. And one of the times you haven't mentioned yet is when he said, you called tens of millions of people deplorable. Yeah. And then her, her answer to that was so terrible. She's yeah. like, I really meant you are. It's like, no, that's not what you said. Yeah. In the comfort of yet another Wall, you know, Wall Street back at Zoom And funny, and, and funny. And fu very funny, And humorous. I agree. That's, that's why it. tonight they're all By the way, that's about, the person I've known for years. Yes, they're all spinning about him being in her space while she's, oh, come on. By that's the, way, the best you that? have. A 90-minute substantive debate, the best you have is he was standing behind her when she was answering. Oh, then, then I'm it. close to you. I'm in your space right now, but you're exactly. in mine too. Okay, <laughs> Kellyanne, thank you. Congratulations. Oh, thank you, Good Sean. night. Thank, thank you. you.